Yeah. I'm gonna make little houses. So I started painting these roofs brown. Put a door on them, and the window. Paint them white first. Gotta let the brown dry. So there we go. Paint. I think I'll paint this one all white. Well, as you can see, all the paint and stuff on my table. I've been doing some painting. So I painted these little houses. They turned out rather cute. And there's the second one. And here's the third one. Thought they were perfect shape for a little house. Oh, I'm gonna paint a door on the back of that. Have to do that yet. So not quite finished. And then I tried my hand at painting a little turtle. Let's put them down, maybe it'll focus better. I'm just going to put him out. Out in the garden. I thought he turned out kind of cute. And of course he has his little tail at the back. And that's his shell. And there's my little turtle. So that's what I've been busy with today. Still have one more rock here. Can't decide what I want to do. I was going to make a little baby turtle, but I think he's too upright. So I have to think about that. Anyhow, these are the houses I painted and the little turtle put out in my garden. Got to give them all a good spray first. So paint doesn't wash off. And I got these paints as a gift once from my husband. And the great, these are a water-based ink. Real brush pens. And they are really good for doing detail on your rocks. They have a nice fine tip. A nice fine tip. And that's how I did some of the turtle and did some of the house lines. Anyhow, that was my fun for today. So I just finished putting the door on the back of the blue and yellow house. And maybe, yeah, I think that's all. So I hope you enjoyed this little bit of a painting thing. I know I did. Thanks for watching. Bye. The ink pens come in many colors. As you can see, I have mine stored in a little pottery pot that I made years ago. And there's lots of colors in there. It was a wonderful present.